Hello, Americans. And other friends, subscribers around the world. That sounded like slow motion. Hello, Americans. <laughs> Did you forget back again? Back again, man. Back again, man. <laughs> that sounded like fast forward. Well, I'll be darned. It got here, man. It got here fast. Mm -hmm. This is a P6. Dude, I am super, I'm super excited super to excited. have the step through for myself. Absolutely. Yes. The only thing, man, that kind of makes me nervous, man, is the uh, box mm -hmm. is bulging out right here. So hopefully no, no damage. And then, of course... The one problem, it's raining outside. So we've just discussed it, and I think that we're going to just do it because we're out in the cookhouse. It's tight, but it's going to be tight. So way. I'm just going to cut the top of the box and start uh, pulling the piece of man out. The packing of these is amazing, and instead of showing the whole put together, you know, because we did a pretty good long yeah. thing of that. I think we're gonna we'll just do some little clips here and there of putting it together and instead of uh, worrying about that so much we'll just do the actual back Ooh, look at the size of them them are four inch tires man can't really tell how uh, how big dude I got big hands how big they are um, right when I opened it and keep, Miss Kitty seen the uh, the tires um, I wish I would have uh, had that or had the camera going then, but I probably would have had to bleep it. <laughs> Whee! Here, I just got to show this amazing. I mean, this even impresses Miss Kitty, and she's the packing queen. Look at this amazing packing job. Look at that. Four inches wide. And then check this out, man. Holy moly. Dang. And these welds, man, just amazing welds. Dude, I'm like a giddy little teenager. It's funny because uh, Miss Kitty, I told my man, you don't, or, or I said, you don't know how excited I am. And she says, uh, what'd you say? said, oh, yes, I do. The very first time you saw an electric bike, you fell in love. <laughs> the big, fat, tired ones, just like this, man. Probably... I don't know how many years when these first came out. And the first one I ever seen up in McCall, I was like, wow. And now it's all mine. Oh, dude. So about uh, probably 15 or 20 minutes, I got it all, you know, put together. Man, I would have done more on the... Uh, putting it together but man it was so tight in there you know I was in the cook cook shack and then uh geez, I am in love man look how tall this thing you know I shared a picture with Miss Kitty it's up to up to my gut man but I've got it set up yeah I should have brought Kitty out here for so I can pretty much sit stand flat footed Got everything all tightened up, and it's starting to rain a little bit out here. Um, right now, I am uh, charging the battery. Sorry, dude. <laughs> See how they're ready. Um, I was looking for accessories. I was going to see if there was a, a fender, you know, because, man, especially, you know, when it's this wet and all this kind of stuff, you know, flipping up your back, but I haven't found any accessories and stuff yet, but I think I'd like to get a, uh, whoa, dude, I think I'd like to get a back fender and a rack for it. Oh, this thing is freaking amazing. And we'll go over all the components and stuff here in, here in a little bit. But right now, man, I just wanted to show, uh, dang, man, amazing, 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 operation, specification, let's see, I'll have to read that little thing, I took off some of, you know, the, I haven't taken off all the warnings and all that stuff yet, so I want to get it all, yeah. Man, that thing is 
badass. You know, I had one of the first when I was a kid. Man, I it was 400 bucks I paid for it. Was a uh, Scorpion mountain bike, and that was uh, oh lord, dude, I must have been fifteen, man. I think it's when right when mountain bikes first came out, man. Four hundred bucks, you know. I was working working at Wendy's, and that's uh, man, I rode that thing. That's how I used to go see Miss Kitty at school every day. Um, then I rode it hundreds of miles. That was my, I didn't have a driver's license or a car, man. That was my, and I went everywhere. But I never dreamed of this, uh, pedal assist, man. It's great. Especially, especially as you're getting older, man. It's really great. Come on in. What do you think of the hose? Oh, is that bad or what? That is huge. That's that a little one. bit too big for you, huh? Mm -hmm. See that you one see, back there? See the that's smaller me, one? Boss. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, that yeah. one's mine. I haven't even got to ride this thing, so we're gonna see if uh, it works. Make sure and put the battery in like this. Is it heavy? Uh, I think it's uh, 62 pounds, I think. Everything all together? Okay, so this one, turn on like this. Let me turn this on. This is the first time that I've turned any of this on because it's been raining. Oh, look at that. Now check this out, check this out. What the? <laughs> Do that. Just a little bit. No, not that. Oh, that Twist. No, like a motorcycle. Nope. Nope. Over here. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to, uh, so we're going to pull these out and, uh, I'm going to ride this. It's going to probably be muddy up my back, man. It's, uh, it's not raining right now, so we're going to give it a try and then I'll still go across the, or, uh, I still gotta do go crop, <laughs> go through all the com you, components while well, you're gonna ride it. Eh? Well, this I haven't even checked the tires on this one. How about this one? I'm gonna have to be like sitting there. I don't even know if you could stand up next to that other one, Tucker. It's huge, just half of my body. Yeah, it is. It's half of my body. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I think that one's even too big. Yeah. So how am I even gonna ride one? No that is fast. Should I try to run up and catch up with them? Is that bad or what? Oh man, it's already muddy, dude. <laughs> is that uh oh that thing's bad. Let me get yours out here so you can. Uh, get, yeah. See, see if, uh, sure, why not? Do I got mud all over my back. I don't see any. Nope. So this one has a really nice kickstand too. That's how you're supposed to do it. Yep. Is that cool? Or uh, it's weird. So you go like that? Next. Yeah, it's cold out here. Is that cool or what? Next, you're gonna push that. No, well, that's just a tester just to see how to turn your battery's charged. Just turn one time. Then you gotta turn the key on. Right, that's yeah, motorcycles. I want, I want one like mine. They have, uh, they make scooters. I know they make those, uh, high, like, scooters that you could just, they go like 31 yeah. miles per hour. The scooters are even faster than these. 
He's a little bit more brave on the puddles because this one has fenders, see? So he won't get yeah, much splatter. Looks like more than half of my body. This, this one's huge. Like I have to go tippy toe just to get it to my lip. Mm hmm. How, how am I going to drive this thing? I'm wondering that. Got it dirty. Just like fun. that. Now we've got to go. We've got to get some, some footage of both of them, Miss Kitty. So just making that quick little loop there, you feel a big Maybe difference? A little, bit. a little bit. Do you get feel a big difference in yeah, the, a lot more power? A lot more power? Yeah. Like off the line power or um, yeah. It's uh um, then I don't want to do all the no. things it, I need to right. look at it and go all over it because I get mm -hmm. the two mixed up. Mm -hmm. But it's 700 and. Yeah, see, I just don't yeah. Do it. yeah. We just wanted to show everybody because it finally stopped raining that he got that all put together. And this is a first time Tucker. This, huh? No, I don't think he could. Get on the, get on the back. <laughs> What? Keep your feet away from that thing. Can you do it? He just needs somewhere to put, put his foot on that. That, mount, that right there. Well, on this side he's got brakes. Well, he got nothing. So he could do the kickstand. Oh well, no, not really. This right there. Just don't be crazy. Okay. Right. I'm telling your bumper, yeah. don't be crazy. <laughs> Little rough on your backside? Yep. That's my butt. I'm supposed to be on the new bike. It's trying. So I don't even think with that seat down, I don't think he's no, I don't think big so. enough mm -mm. for that. Is that cool or what? Chris. Mm -hmm. Get Chris. Get Chris. Mm -hmm. Oh, dude, oh. it's big. It's yeah, big. It is. <laughs> I, have to, I have to put my full leg yep. just to do this. Yep. Mm -hmm. and that's not, yeah, that ain't no good. No. You're going to have to grow before you can do it. Maybe in a couple years, huh? Unless if is that Sunday a small good height for you? Just kidding. Well, uh, I'd have to try it. I'll try it. I don't know. Did you move it since the last time I no, but, tried it? No, but it squished down, I think. Why don't you go ride it? You have to turn your thing on. Push your back. <laughs> okay, you've always done it for me. So there. Since this is now officially my that's bike, right. that's right. Then I guess I'm gonna have to. You're gonna, gonna have to learn to do. I'm on it, huh? That's right. Let's go. Well, I don't know if I want to use the power through the mud. Move it. Move it, Chris. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you do. <laughs> What are you doing? I want to try a little bit. What are you talking about? I'm going through the mud with the power is the best thing to do. Until I spin out, that's what soup. No, it ain't going to spin out. Wow. <laughs> okay, let me go catch up with her. Grizz. Grizz. I don't know about this mud right here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you ran your dog over. I did. He almost hit my leg. To go out to pave it? Uh, not quite, but almost, yeah. Oh, really? You didn't cruise down it? Oh, no, I had somebody following me. Yeah, it's super muddy. I can't keep up. I kind of did. 
So we need to pack a lime to go hit the trail. Yeah, for sure. I'm gonna run mine out on the out okay. of the road for okay. a How am I gonna? Are you gonna sit on this thing? How? Well, I'm, I'm teasing, bud. Oh, good dang it. I'd much rather you could do this. Yeah. You don't need to go run alongside of me. <laughs> this thing flies. Woo. Back. I can't see your back. This thing, man, is amazing and fast. Super fast, man. So fast <laughs> see how fast I went? Yeah. That thing's cool, huh? Yeah, that thing, uh, so I'm going to have to go over all the components and then we're going to uh, load them up. Hopefully, we're going to get a break in this weather. In the next couple days and high boy wanted some uh more footage of us snow, snow. yeah so i need to straighten my handlebars just a little bit check the air in the tires check the air in the tires and uh we're gonna figure out we're gonna have to stuff both of these in the van or the exploder mm -hmm. won't be able to do it today because we don't have a third one for TNT. Mr. Man. But, uh, I can do yours here. Turn it down. I don't know if you can fit three in there. Yeah. Three in there. It's going to be a trick sticking two yeah. in there. So that's it for now, man. Did you push record? I did. <laughs> All right. So, Miss Kitty, we just did this whole review video, or half of it, and she realized that she didn't push the button to record this. Mm hmm. So. Mm -hmm. So here we go. First of all, let's go back over everything that I said. First of all, I had this thing on. You know, I would pulled it over here and had it on. And got off of it, man, and was arranging it to do this video. And put my hand on the handlebars. And, dude, it shot out of my hands. So if you ain't on this thing, you always want to make sure that you have it off. So let's go over how you turn this on now this one's different than the other for turning on here down here right here you push this button till the blue indicator light comes on and then you go over here to the controller push this and hold it till boom and now she's ready to ready to rock and roll Alrighty. and then to turn it off you just hold this boom that goes off and the indicator light goes off. So, so that's how you turn. So as soon as you push those buttons, these lights yes, start to walk. Yes, once you okay. hold this, it turns it off. Okay. And to get your battery out, see the other one, like Miss Kitty's, um, you have to use the key, you know, to turn your to turn it on. You know, mm -hmm. just like you use a push button here, mm -hmm. you have to use a key to turn yours on. This the only time that you need the key is when you want to take the battery out. Uh huh. So that's that's different. And then the um, max weight. That they say on this is 265 pounds so that's the max weight and then for height you know like if you put your seat down farther or whatever i think it's from five four oh my god you got enough room there? five four to six six you know is the height you know so you could stand flat footed on it should have been here a minute ago because katie joe my daughter when she's pretty short sure, what is katie five two about Something that. like that. She uh, she tried to get on it, man. It was it, it was too tall. It was uncomfortable for her. Yes, yeah, so yeah. It's got a uh, 750 watt brushless motor, and that actually uh, that what is it? Buffang. I'd looked up, and it is rated one of the best motors on the market. So that was pretty uh, pedal cool. Pedal assist. So you can go 31 miles if you're just using the power and 62 miles if you're using the pedal. Then it's supposed to go uh, 21.7 miles per hour is what they're saying. And man, let me tell you what, this thing compared to the other one.
So another one I keep referring to is the EX6. And that was the first bike that they sent us out. And then dude, this this one is you know way more radical, dude. I had mountain bikes when I was a kid once the mountain bikes came out. And I also raced BMX. I'm not quite as radical as I was back then, but this thing, this thing will make you want to get radical. Okay, it's got 24 inch, four inches wide tires on that thing, man. Which I actually need to check yeah. the pressure. But them, them tires, dude. Yeah. I don't know if this will. Yeah. yeah. I mean, they are just massive. And then it's got adjustable shocks up here. Up there you know, shock, shock absorbers. So you can take it and, uh, you know, it's hydraulic front shocks. So that, man, that'll be nice. I mean, you can, you know, if you're on pavement, you obviously wouldn't need the shocks. But, but if you're on bumpy, crazy stuff, then you could, do, you know, turn it up. I haven't played with that. I haven't actually got to ride this thing that much because of the weather. Um, oh, yeah, the other is... Uh, Versus, uh, what you doing? No, man? Oh, it's the got detail. the little, yeah, I need to take you that off. Take that clear plastic off. This is a nine speed, where the other one's uh, seven speed, I think, is the other one. It's a seven speed, nine speed. Man, I'm telling you, this thing out of the gate is just and this so is your, quick. yep, this here. Yeah, let me make sure it's on. Huh? Yeah, yep, this is your accelerator, and then you can, you know, switch your gears here, and then it's also got, I think, this one's. Up and this one's down, mm -hmm. I believe. But um, man, what else? It's just oh man, this thing is just amazing. Okay, so then I put the key on my key ring so I wouldn't lose it. And then to get your battery out, you do that with your key, and then it's a slide, slide battery just like that. You put your battery in. Actually, you don't even need the key to put your battery in. You can take the key out. And it just clicks right into place. Just like that. Oh, and then it's got the... Uh, turn it on. Front light. Oh, there it is. Yep, yeah, got the front light and the... Oh, you got a horn. Your horn is louder than my horn. Oh, you think so? Or is it just because you're standing in front of it? Maybe. Cause <laughs> and for, um, on the rear, mine has a rear Yeah, uh, hers has light. a rear tail light, and hers has, uh, um, Fenders. Fenders. See now, see, now the fenders... Just a reflector back here, guys. Yep. Yeah. And there's actually a reflector, um, there was one on the handlebars, and I actually removed it. But I'm going to put a, you know, a camera mount and stuff on here. Man, this thing, dude, my plan is to, you know, first of all, I think I'm going to get me a rack. And then I was thinking, you know, when I get the rack, is I could probably put something underneath the rack. Solid, you know, and make it right. like a fender. Right. You know, so I'm more than anything. And it's got the, you know, the holes here to do a rack. Mm. So I've got, you know, nice. I don't know if they sell the accessories or not for that or if your rack maybe i'll steal your rack off you. <laughs> <laughs> but i definitely want to get me a rack and then uh like i said put something underneath and then i'll probably get me a you know definitely a kind of a fender mostly just for you know man especially this time of year and we're getting ready to go do some riding man and i'm gonna guaranteed i'm gonna have the mud up my back because it is mm -hmm. super wet out here but i think that's all the um, everything I need to go over, man. Dude, I'm just super excited, and thank you so much for this opportunity. And now we're going to go play in some, uh, some snow on some trails and check this thing out.